The Infernal Horde is a wave-based survival mode that ends in a unique boss fight. It's designed for endgame players, but you can start playing it once you reach World Tier 3. To unlock the Infernal Horde, finish the quest The Eyes of the Enemy on Nightmare Difficulty, find Locren and Estelle in Zarbinzet Hoazar. Completing the quest rewards you with a free Infernal Compass. It's like a Nightmare Dungeon Sigil, but for the Infernal Horde. Infernal Compasses come in different tiers. The tier affects enemy strength, rewards, and the number of waves. You can get these compasses from Whisper Bounties, Nightmare Dungeons, the Pit of Artificers, Helltide Chests, or by crafting them through the Occultist. Use Abyssal Scrolls to upgrade your compasses tier for better rewards. But remember, this is permanent. In each Infernal Horde run, your goal is to finish all waves, defeat the Fell Council, and collect Burning Aether. Spend the Aether on spoils of Hell Chests. There are four types of chests, each with specific items, but the spoils of greater equipment is only available on Tier 3 or higher Infernal Hordes. It's not easy, especially as you progress to higher tiers and face more monsters in each wave. So there you have it. The Infernal Hordes is a test of skill, strategy, and endurance. But don't be afraid to experiment with different builds and playstyles to find what works best for you. Good luck, and if this guide helped you in any way, please like the video and subscribe to Wimplays for more Diablo for content.